In this video, I'm going to be walking you through what I think and why I think it in a live online game of Madden 21. What's up, guys? My name is Cody, and I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Now, if you're new to the channel and you don't know what my channel is all about, my channel is all about how to become a better Madden player in Madden 21. And so if you're looking to get better at this game, I want to 100% encourage you to go ahead and hit that subscribe button at the bottom right hand corner of your screen. It's going to allow you to stay up to date with everything that we have coming out on our channel. We post tips and strategies every single day. And so if you want to know whenever a new video goes live, go ahead and turn on that notification icon by hitting that little bell icon next to the subscribe subscribe button. Alright guys, so I am working out of my Nickel 335Y defensive ebook and my New York Jets latest offensive ebook. So really excited to jump into today's video now. Uh, looks like I'm going to be coming out placing some eye close right off the bat here. Um, probably one of my least favorite formations to have to defend is eye close uh, just because of the fact that they do have that threat of the run and I absolutely just do not dis just despise it when people run the ball but we're gonna lock in here and see what we can do now like I said I am running the New York Jets defense or uh, offensive playbook and then on on defense I'm running um, or I apologize on offense I am running the New York Jets offensive playbook so I've got the the four six defense uh, and the and the New York Jets offense uh, on on the, as far as schematics go. So right here, just gonna see what he's doing, what his route combos are. Um, now I am working a little bit more out of cover three than I have been in the recent days. And again, the big reason for that is because of the latest patch. Cover three now plays a little bit different than it used to, and so I'm kind of kind of um, just honestly testing this out a little bit uh, and just kind of seeing where it goes from here. So uh, starting out again, like I said, you know we're just gonna have some very simple uh, cover schemes here and it uh, looks like my opponent is going to go ahead and do a little motion here so we're going to try and get some pressure wrap the a gap get that running back manned up for that little quick route and we are able to get a nice little stop there bringing up a second down and 12 defensively you're going to see here that i am going to just simply kind of try to fill up my opponent here uh, i'll show you my coaching adjustments here i'm going to put ball in their defense on play ball option defense is on conservative Flats are on 25, curl flats are on 10, and hooks are on 5 until I adjust it as that's kind of my starting point. And then from there, I will definitely adjust as the game goes on. So as you see here, you know, just Mike puts 3 right now, just kind of keeping it really simple. Um, and we'll see here, 2nd and 12 looks like, again, strong close for my opponent. Um, do a little quick routes, little quick routes right there, right there. And good read by him on that little PA cross right there now honestly i'm probably sending a little bit too much pressure so i need to back off a little bit on the blitz uh, being very aggressive against these under center formations the next thing that i am going to do is probably go to some man coverage here just to kind of see how my opponent handles that so i'm going to send some pressure here uh, and send some man pressure just to kind of see you know how does he handle that real quick here just to kind of you know just see what happens here does he run the ball it does look like you see here a uh, little motion snap and i know i gotta watch out for like a motion slant or something but like right here there's that instant instant pressure that we talk about in the ebook and that's what we're talking about now if you want to get my full defensive ebook it is available in the description for just 15 bucks you can get the whole defensive system the whole defensive scheme that shows you literally how to box every single thing that anybody can do offensively in this game you can get that for just 15 bucks in the description so if you want to get that that is available as you'll see here we're going to send that user rush one more time and right there good read by my opponent just going to a little quick route right there and that's going to set up a third down and three now on this third down and three situation i actually really really um I really have uh, enjoyed this this coverage that you're going to see that I'm going to go to right here. He's going to go to I-form close. You got to think Power O might be in the works here. So I'm going to spy both safeties, and there you go. Good pressure right at the middle, and we're able to come down and make some good stops. That's going to put him in a fourth down situation. It's a long field goal, so I wouldn't be surprised if my opponent does go for this right here. So, you know, one of the other things that I recommend is you can obviously change your zone drops based on situations. So like right here, we're in a little bit more of a 5-5-15 five, five, and 15 here situation for this different types of settings. And so we're going to go back to that Mike Fitz 3 here. But this time what we're going to do is have really, really, really um, crystal clear, you know, underneath coverage here. Obviously, we're expecting a little quick slant right there on that left side here. We're going to jump to that, jump to that, try to take that away. And then we just got to make a tackle. 
good stop for the defense and even though he's five of five we're able to get off the field and make it happen now on offense i am running the new york jets offensive uh, playbook right now it is the best offense that i have ever used um, in this game it is so simple and is so so effective so if you want to get that full ebook that is available in the description and again same thing as the the defense it's just 15 dollars for it um and you get the whole thing you get you get the whole bunch uh bunch uh ebook here so uh anyway it's gonna start with my favorite play uh right now and my favorite play right now is 100 percent got to be this flood concept this flood passing concept is so simple um but to be honest with you it is so 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 effective as you can see right here this in route this out route just the, the dig and the dag of these concepts they just work hand in hand and so you're gonna see a lot of this you know early on here i'm gonna try to abuse the flats really um and just honestly kind of see what he's doing with his user he's gonna give up that in route one more time we're gonna just take it and uh, we're right off the bat to it too now what i like to do on my first drive is I like to move quick. I like to see how he's gonna handle that. I like to see how he's gonna handle my pace. Is he gonna blitz? You know, what is he gonna do? How's he gonna stop it? Uh, right there, ran a little uh, seven, little five man pressure with hard flats on the outside there. So good defense by him. It does look like he's kind of running some standard coverages, um, just running some hard flats, running some running some uh, three three five wide. So that's something I'm gonna have to watch out for. But it's sitting here audible down um, three three five wide into that Mike Blitz three. So obviously he knows a little bit of something something. Uh, as far as the meta goes you know and again right here we're just going to kind of wait you see here his user is kind of scared of that in route so we're able to then take that quick route now what this tells me as far as what he's doing defensively is he's either sitting pressure but he's not necessarily taking away really anything here so i'm going to try to hit this running back out here quick right there just a little quick read right there over the middle just kind of keep him thinking about different things different options than i have um, as an offensive player in this game here now right here going to go to a little bit more of a standard setup at a flood um, and you'll see here that just the flats and then right there a little low ball dot over the middle Tavon austin touchdown packers and that is the bunch for you the bunch just moves quick the pace is quick it's moving it's it's hot reads quick reads as long as you read this offense correctly and you kind of call the right place at the right times you are going to have a ton of success it is very difficult for the defense to be able to stop this offense especially if you're moving at a relatively quick and smooth pace you're going to be able to have a lot of success and so as you see right there we get up and uh, we're going to get seven points on the board now defense is going to jump back out into the field of play here and honestly defensively we're in a good spot we can hold him to three uh, we just ideally would want to get the ball back before um, the two minute warning if possible to be able to go down and score some more points so uh, really quick if you guys have any questions about this video anything that i'm running on offense or defense you can always hit me up via text message my cell phone number is 208-218-6900 that's also in the top left hand corner of your screen so if you want to hit me up just hit me up and uh, i'd love to talk with you if you want to get my free um my free offensive and defensive schemes that I release every single week to the people that have joined my text message membership, which is completely free. Every week I break down one hour schemes, whether it be the strong close, the, the bunch, the bunch tight end. I've, I've broken down all kinds of stuff um, over the past several months here. But if you want to get those those schemes, all you got to do is text the word the text the word Madden to my new cell phone number, which is 208-218-6900. It's also in the description of this video. Just text the word Madden and uh, should automatically send you that playlist every time we update it um, which we update that every single Saturday um, and so you know good stuff on that but anyways right here a little Mabel coverage here just kind of changes some things up obviously he's gonna have to be worried about the pressure but we don't want that to just kind of control everything now here is kind of a popular setup here so we're gonna go to slant and then go there and there's that little uh, little wheel route right there to the back we were totally expecting that we need to be a little bit better a little sharper on the coverage on that side of things because they will throw they will throw those little running back wheel routes out of the backfield um that do them a, you know a really good job so right here we're gonna go to a little bit of pressure a little bit of man pressure here just kind of see how he handles that um because we haven't sent pressure yet and obviously he's got a slant route coming back across the face 
but we're gonna try to gonna get in there with that quick pressure and there's the pressure once again takes away that snap throw read and then as you can see that's gonna bring up a second down and 17. picking and choosing your spots against strong close is so 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 important you have to pick and choose your spots against strong close if you're gonna be effective in my opinion and that's gonna bring up a second down and 17 three minutes and 12 seconds left on the clock now right here um you're gonna see what i'm gonna do is i'm actually gonna go with a little bit more underneath coverage i'm not gonna uh i'm not going to you know i'm not going to shy away from that so i've got several underneath coverage here i do have uh, a hard a hard flat out there a little 25 yard flat but anything crossing my face i have to go take that uh, and as you can see there a little quick read and that's going to keep everything in front of us put us in a third down and 11 situation so defensively you see kind of the idea i'm trying to force him to throw in the middle of the field uh, and take away a lot of his snap throw uh quick reads here so make him hold the ball let zadarius smith do his thing um now right here it's kind of decision time do you send pressure do you go coverage we've sent so much pressure here but actually right here we're going to go ahead and use a rush right up the a gap that's one of the beauties of the 335 wide if they run play action oftentimes you can run right up the a gap gets us a big stop in a big situation and now we're going to force a punt and like i said we get the ball back with three timeouts with the two minute warning offense has been clicking on all cylinders on the first drive so hopefully we'll be able to get the ball back be able to go down score get seven points go up by two possessions heading into halftime because remember we do get the ball at halftime it's always important i say this every inside the mind video whenever you're playing a game of madden 21 you want to be kicking the ball off you do not want to be receiving the ball first it is absolutely essential like you're never out of a game if you kick the ball off if you kick the ball off first never out of a game if you get the ball first and second half in my opinion but when it's the other way around it's actually such a critical thing because it is just so important to have that additional possession that extra possession that you can have in your back pocket um at the end of the game there when that second half so right here just going to be more flood right here just going to try to see kind of how he defends this uh, we are going to take our quick flat read um a lot of people don't understand that those flats are actually really really effective even if they're not running even if they're running uh zone drops so for example if they run a five yard curl flat oftentimes the curl flat does not get out there all the way on this route um, and so it's something that you can kind of take as you see right there just taking the flats for about four yards uh, it's something so simple but man it is something that makes a huge difference um, as far as how everything is going to work for us right there gyro Alexander actually jumped me um, and it's honestly a really really big turnover and I missed a tackle he's gonna get a pick six absolutely huge play in this ball game absolutely huge play in this ball game Jair Alexander is one of the most important and this is why it is so important if you're playing mutt you want to make sure that you have acrobat on every single person you possibly can because of that right there he's able to get the interception and now that's going to put me in a situation where I was about to go up by two possessions with ball coming out of half now I'm in a position where I'm you know I'm not even up one possession we're tied so what I need to do is I need to get the ball I need to go down I need to score if it's three it's fine if it's seven it's great but I just need to go down and score to the football um in this next one minute and 18 seconds it's just a bad decision by me bad read it wasn't open i was trying to force a little something i didn't think jair alexander would jump it acrobat goes crazy he ends up making the play and that's a good play by him so now uh, i've got to make some moves make some things happen on the offense side of the ball i need to go down and score it doesn't have to be a field or it doesn't have to be a touchdown but it definitely need to go down in the field and score on this drive so gonna be a little bit more you know careful uh this time with that with that read I do sometimes fall in love a little bit too much uh, with that out route right there. So we're gonna go back to the in route, dot over the middle of the Valdez Scantling, and, uh, and hopefully be able to get the ball down the field and work the ball now he's been running a lot of um he has been running a lot of mabel coverage so what we're going to do is go to that mike blitz three um just kind of get in a situation here and it does look like he is going to go ahead um it does interesting defense by him right there honestly uh but good man up on the running back side of things that's actually a really really smart decision uh and we're going to go down into a second and three situation so Good defense by him. Now, what we're totally expecting right here is for him to man up on that running back side. Right there, it's probably a bad decision to throw that. Um, if you can't smart route that option route, it doesn't always have enough space to get open, but we are able to get it open right there. Now, in this drive right here, it does look like he's going to be in a situation. So, what I'm doing right here is we're just kind of going in between an option route and some other things. But what I'm going to do on this left side is I'm actually going to go ahead and do that little drag route. Love this drag route read here. And we're going to hit that out route late. 
and that's kind of the read we're trying to hit before that puts us in field goal range and now we're in a position where we can't blow it right we're in a position where we need to execute we need to get down there and we need to score uh and so i'm gonna go to a little play here z spot a little bit of a max protect play just kind of taking a shot at the corner of the end zone honestly just trying to see if i can pop if i can get this read in but you'll see right here he is going to go at the heavy pressure so we're just going to take that little flat out route little quick read out there to table on austin we're probably gonna run the same play but we are going to be coming out in the bunch trail the reason i'm going to be coming out in bunch trail is we have not hit him with a skinny post yet now right here we're actually going to be going to the smash return uh and again he is showing heavy 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 pressure so we're going to id the mic on the left we're going to slide protect on the back side and then we're going to give ourselves just a little quick read right there in case anything uh breaks down and we are going to do a little bit of that flat. We're just reading that flat. If he does blitz and he does blitz me, we're going to try to get that ball out. Vada scaling got out of bounds. Perfect. Puts us in a situation. We got first and goal on the three yard line. This is a decent drive to end the half. We just need to make sure we close it out with at least three points. Again, remember what our goal was. Whenever you're on a drive, you need to define what is a win? What is a goal for this drive? What is something that is going to be good? If I, What good can come of this? Those are things that you have to identify because if you don't know them, then it's going to be hard to execute them. So right there, even if we didn't get a touchdown on the drive, we were able to hit mesh post, but I was fully comfortable just taking a sack, falling down, taking three points. That was 100% of my comfort zone. So just know that I wasn't necessarily going for a touchdown. Obviously, it was a nice to have, but really what I was trying to do is I was trying to get up field and get a field goal because I realized that I get ball at a halftime. And it's absolutely critical that I can get up by two possessions. If I can go up by two possessions in the second half, that's what I want to be at the minimum here. So, uh, anyways, we're going to kick the ball off. And like I said, if you guys want any, um, if you want any, you know, have any questions about anything that I'm talking about, just text me. My cell phone number is in the top left-hand corner of your screen. And if you also want to get those free schemes that I release every single week, every week we release a scheme, we sit down for about an hour and break something down, whether it be the gun bunch, whether it be the bunch tight end, the trips tight end, we've done all kinds of them in the past. So if you want to get access to those videos, those are both defensive and offensive, go ahead and text the word Madden to my cell phone number, which is in the top left-hand corner of your screen. All right, here we're going to play a little bit of risky. Honestly, we're going to be sending some pressure uh, at the quarterback, just kind of trying to see if we can get some pressure in here uh, and just kind of catch him off guard a little bit here. And he is going to block crib. So we need to get back on this crosser. It's absolutely critical. And we got a little throw out of sack. Jair Alexander comes back for me with a pick of his own. Now, this is really important. You see a little stick work there to get me upfield. And now I'm going to get myself in a position where I can get three points absolutely critical this is a huge field goal this is an absolutely huge field goal there that's a huge interception it's exactly why we sent the pressure it looks like he is going to go ahead and quit out but what would have happened is we would have gone up by three so we've gone up by two possessions we've been 17 to 7 going into the second half and then we would have had ball coming into half with a really really good position to be able to go up by multiple possessions so thanks for watching this video i hope you enjoyed it if you want to get the full ebook the offensive ebook is in the description the defensive ebook is in the description and both of them can be picked up for just 15 bucks thanks for your time and we'll see you guys on stream tonight at 10 p.m eastern time